News 8 continues our Wait to Text campaign. Today we're sharing a story about a teenager who's trying to help get the message out about the dangers of texting and driving to her peers. Take a look. Amity High School students in Woodbridge are getting a lesson on the dangers of texting and driving from one of their peers. There's obviously a million and two statistics out there that I could share with you guys. 18-year-old Casey Del Basso, who wears the Miss Hamden crown, has hopes of one day being named Miss Connecticut. To achieve her goal, she's spreading the word about the dangers of texting and driving one high school at a time. It was really important for to talk to my peers from one of their peers about texting and driving and how we can make a difference together to stop it and stop stop all these deaths on the road. In addition to selling her own colorful thumb bands, Casey gets the message across by showing AT&T's last text documentary. It's, it's funny, the, the first thing I noticed about her was her shoes. <laughs> Lying in the roadway in a, in a large pool of blood, I noticed her shoes and I thought, this is a young girl. That's the first thing I thought when I saw this. And at that point is when I noticed her cap and gown was still in her car. She was going to graduate the next day. These are true stories from people whose lives have been completely changed because of accidents caused while texting and driving. Her truck flipped and as it was flipping she was actually ejected through the driver's side door and she landed in the ditch about 300 feet from her truck. People will tell you over and over again it's not your fault. But knowing that you were the person that she was talking to when she was killed. Just knowing, having a highway patrol officer write in a report that a text message sent at 12.05 is the reason that she is dead is not something that will ever go away. It's a chilling reality that in hopes will leave a lasting impression not only on high school students, but anyone who watches it. Well, I think they hear it coming from another 18 year old and they really want to get involved and want to stop because sometimes when your parents or your teachers are lecturing you about a topic, it's kind of like, okay, we're done. But when they hear it from me, it's really great and they, every student has been great and they've responded in such a great way.